up YouTube you guys it's your girl Jalisa and I am back with another freaking video you guys and I'm doing a part two on my day in the life as a female security guard at LI Universal so um today I just wanted to let y'all know that like about the pay at LI Universal so the pay isn't all that so today I decided that, well I haven't decided yet, but I'm really kind of thinking about not working at LI Universal anymore because of the fact that they don't pay enough. They pay weekly, but they don't pay enough. And, give me one second. This is our work phone, we have to answer. Hello, Jaleesa speaking. Yes, I'm going to find out who do I need to speak with regarding uh, my badge not working. Um, do you need to be let in a building? Yeah, um, every morning, yes, I have to be. I have to call and have somebody to come down and let me in. Um, let me call my manager and I'll give you a call back on who to speak with because I'm not sure. Okay, all right, thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Bye. <laughs> so, y'all, so y'all, don't, don't mind that phone call, but that's what we have to do, actually. We have to answer the phone and sometimes people badge doesn't work. So we have to let them in and sometimes um people don't have a badge and it's like somebody who's coming here to see someone and we have to let them in they be like i'm at 975 building or i'm at this a building b building f building stuff like that and i need to be let in the building and we have to let them in other than that so like i said in the last video we have to do a daily report a daily activity report um, it's just stating what's today's date, what's your duty um, as an officer, and you have to let them know what goes on throughout the entire shift. Let me show y'all how it looks. You see, and then down here, we have to write down every t all of the times of everything that has happened, and you know, put our signature right here. Also, um, we have to watch cameras all the time but nothing really happens in this building um y'all i just wanted to let y'all know about the pay though because the pay is really not enough for me and although we get paid every week the pay is just not enough for me and i just feel like i really like li university because it's a real chill job like literally y'all this is what i do all day i be on my phone um, we don't really watch the cameras like that because nothing happens in this building and um, like literally nothing happens in this building. Um, I just sit here all day and you know go to, I end up falling asleep or I end up um, just doing nothing you know being on my phone or whatever or I answer, answer the phone call when someone calls but other than that it's like really nothing to do like at all. Um, it's a really smooth job. But the fact that this job, like, this is the lowest paying LI Universal um, location that I have ever worked. Because this location pays $10.71. And to be honest, y'all, I was just working here to, like, get some fast, get something quick to go ahead and start working. Because I had just quit my other job. But now that I've been here for a month, I'm ready to go. Because... It's not enough money for me. Anywho, I just thought that I'll let you guys know that. Give me one second. Let me call the manager um, for this woman. But yes, y'all. Y'all should give LI Universal a try because it's really cool, but it has its ins and outs. You know, bads and goods. You know? Hello? Um, hey Ebony, it's a woman who's trying to get in. Well, she said her badge never works, it never works no days. So I asked her if she wanted me to let her in or whatever, but she don't, she don't, she just wants to see who she can speak with about her badge not working. For which, for which building? Um, I don't know. She just, I don't know. I think she's in 975. 975? Yeah, I think she is. Well, I mean, if you're not nearby her, we can, I mean, I can't help her if you're not, are you nearby her? No, I'm not. I told her I was going to give her a call back because she's just trying to see who she can speak with about not, I mean, about her 
card not working. It's never working. Okay, so I'm going to reach out to her manager and also reach out to Well Tower Property Management. Okay, I will. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But yes, I'm going to show y'all around my job because I showed y'all in my last video, but I really did not show y'all. Let me go show y'all. I'll be right back. So y'all, we really don't look. We go through this to get go through this door and you know all of this. Um, this is where everyone works, or they come in to come speak with someone. And this is actually 993 building D. And if they want to know like what floor or whatever to go on, we do that. We show them like um if they want to know like what suite to go on, it's four four, like whatever the first number is, that's what floor they go on. And it also shows that right here. Let me show y'all around. Y'all, it's really busy out here today. Let me show y'all around. So y'all, we have to let them through these, um, through the the vehicle gates, the vehicle gates. Um, sometimes because maybe their car doesn't work, we have to let them through here. Um. Also, we have the. Also, we have the um, COVID tent. Let me show y'all the COVID tent. This is the COVID tent where people come and take COVID tests and day night, when people come and take COVID tests, we just scan them in and let them in. Normally we just sit here. I don't think the COVID test is open today. I think it's open on certain days through certain hours, but this is our COVID tent. Um, yeah, it's not open. And we, we give them, you know, we give them hand sanitizer because people are still with the COVID, of course. It's so hot out here, y'all. Y'all, and then I said that nothing don't really happen out here is because I work at a hospital. Nothing really happens at a hospital, really, like, in danger. So that's why I said nothing really happens. And then... All we do is rover around. We literally walk all up through here, all up through there. Just really walk around to make sure it's nobody just sitting around who's not supposed to be out here or something. That's all we do. But we do this like every, we don't, we rarely do this. We do this like, um, maybe like out the entire eight hour shift, we do this like two times. So yeah, because we know that it'd be very empty like this. It'd be very, very empty like this. People who are here, I mean, all of the cars who are here, they mainly work here. So nothing really goes on out here, but yeah. Guys, I just wanted to show you guys around my job of working at LI Universal. You maybe should get a tr give it a try. Yeah, I said that you should give it a try only because I have to work a certain shift due to the fact that I have a baby. So it's kind of hard to find the shift that I'm able to work. But if you're able to work overnight shift or you're able to work um, like second shift, which is two to 10 or three to 11, then you're fine. But other than that, the morning shift is really hard to find. And that's the shift that I have to work because I have to work that shift to work in the hours of my son. It's daycare. So that's why I really don't get paid much. But I'm looking for another job and I may use this job as my second job and just work here. Saturdays and Sundays, seven to seven, a 12 hour shift. But 
Also guys, armed security officers get paid so much more. So if you're interested in armed security, armed security get paid more than unarmed. So you guys should also give that a try. Hello, Julie. You, um, you need to get on the roof? Okay, so you need to get in the gate, in the door. Yes, you need to get in the door, 993C building. Okay. Yes, here I come. But yes, y'all. I just thought that I should show y'all around the entire job because it's really, really smooth, really, really easy. You just have to pay attention and just do your job. Like, just do your job. Like I said, armed security officers, they think that armed security officers are more of police officers. That's why I would never do that because I'm a security officer, but I'm an unarmed security officer and I'm not told to really do too much, you know? But yes, y'all, if you like this video, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Press the notification bell so you can be notified every time I post. And yes, guys. Um, 993C. I think they were already let in. It was someone just calling to let to be let in this building. <sighs> let me call them back. It's so hot out here.